Hi, welcome to a little bit of Common Crazy. Today I'm gonna to share with you my tips for how to avoid stress and anxiety in crowds while you're with your children. Hi, my name is Jennifer and my goal here is to try to find more calm in all the crazy and put some order to the chaos. If you can't tell, I am definitely not at home. I am at Thanksgiving Point. This is the Curiosity Museum and I just found a nice little quiet spot. I wanted to quickly share with you some tips on how to avoid stress and anxiety when you're in a crowd with your kids. Now I am not necessarily an expert at this, but I have definitely learned a thing or two while traveling for the past month and I'm always also willing to ask a friend for some help and advice when I'm struggling personally with any situation that may be going on. So that's exactly kind of what I did today. I was talking with my friends and they really thought that this would be a great thing to share with you today and that's exactly what I'm gonna do. But before we get started, I would love for you to subscribe to my channel and if you click that little bell, that is how you get notified every time that I upload a video. In the past, I have shared with you tips on how to help you through your anxiety, no matter what the situation is that you have, just to feel a little bit better on your day-to-day -day situations. And I will link that video right up here so you can check that out. Today is specifically on how to help you while you're in a crowd with your kids. Tip number one, be prepared. Before you go someplace, make sure that you know what all the different amenities are, what do they have to offer, what are the activities that are there, does it include all age of children, what includes your younger children, what would include your older children. So be well prepared on the place that you are going to attend and you will find that you are less stressed and anxious. Tip number two, be present. This is a really good time to stay off your social media. You can post pictures later, and share those with your friends. But at this time, just try to put that phone away other than I know we all wanna use it for a camera, but really just be present at the activity that you're in and don't worry about the outside factors if you're able to. I know sometimes that's easier said than done. Some of us have to work while we play and I get that. But if you're able to just kind of set some of that aside for a little bit, even if it's just a little bit, you will find that you stay a lot more calm and a lot less stressed. Tip number three, make sure where you are going is child and parent friendly. Here at the Curiosity Museum at Thanksgiving Point, it's kind of like a spider and every room kind of spreads off down a different way. So you have like a circular hallway in the middle and inside each room, there's only one exit. So if I just wanna sit down with my friends and talk to them and let the kids run around, then I know that I have a place where they can find me and also where I have eyes so I can see if anyone wants to go from that room to another room. So that way we can make sure that we are all staying together and staying safe and that gives me peace of mind so that helps keep my stress and anxiety down. Tip number four, use the buddy system. Whether that is you wanna team up your children with one another or what I like to do is bring friends along. I find that when I bring friends, even though it's more kids, my kids are a lot happier and less Oh, let's just say there's less fighting among them when they have someone else to play with. So using the buddy system is a really great way to help you feel a little bit less stressed and anxious about a busy, crowded area. Another idea that goes along with this, if you're able to, is pair an older child with a younger child. So in our situation here today, we have a teenager from one friend who is a fabulous teenager she is like the world's best babysitter and she is paired with a toddler of another friend he absolutely loves and adores her and wants to be with her anyway but his mom is able to kind of sit back and relax because she knows that he is being well taken care of and watched out for tip number five if you're able to i told you about the buddy system for your friends but bring a buddy along for yourself i have to tell you the best part about being out here today is i have friends with me and that makes this a lot less stressful and a lot less anxious for me i love that i can talk to my friends even if one of my children is having kind of a frustrating moment and we are having to figure that situation out i have friends there to help me through that situation and that is helping me stay calm and keep it easy, which is exactly what I want. We're on vacation here. I don't want to stress. I want to have fun. I want my kids to have fun. By doing these five simple tips, then we, we all have a better chance of anxiety and stress-free. I hope that you find these tips helpful. I sure know that they help me out a lot. Don't forget, I post every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, and I would love for you to give this video a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel, and I will catch you in the next video. Bye.